My Tony Time project is called $25 to Charity. It's my project to research many charities in the world and decide which one is the best and can do the most with $25. Originally for my Tony Time project, I was going to create a water filter because of my passion for science. But I came across a very disturbing article on the website called The Rehydration Project that said that every 26 seconds a child dies from diseases caused by dehydration. This new awareness of people not having access to necessities initiated the creation of $25 to Charity. The goal of my project is to read the, um, is to improve or sustain someone's life by donating to the best charity. I knew that it would be difficult from the beginning, but sticking to my plan is what made it happen in the end. The first step of my plan was to define best, because if there is no best charity without best, this required a lot of reflection. <laughs> I had to ask myself why I, was, why I was doing this project. My answer was that I wanted the world to be a better place. If I chose a charity from only one cause, I would only ever help only one element of the world, but if I chose to charity for multiple causes, I would help improve the entire world. One of the qualities of best would be a charity having multiple causes. Another thing that I ask myself is if people who are, who are not dependent on money should be receiving money from a charity. Um, my answer was that, um, that a charity's top priority should be to help those who are in need. Who are in need. So this would be another quality of best. In the end, I came up with the best criteria ever. It must, the charity must be happy with uh, fair necessities. It must also have many causes. Um, at least 80% of the money donated has to go to the cause and not to the administration. And people receiving the money must be dependent. The next step of my project was to research. So I came up with this to organize my research. The first box, charity, is simply the name of the charity. The next box, about, was when it was founded and who it was founded by. If it came down to two very similar charities, this would come in handy because I would choose the one that's older because they would have more experience. The amount of money donated can usually, there is usually a percentage. Hopefully it looks something like that because I'm looking for at least 80% 80, 80 of the money to go to the cause and not to the administration. Um, what is this charity helping? Is the cause? I, hopefully it has more than one because that's what I'm looking for in the charity. The pros are everything that the charity follows as the best criteria ever. Cons are everything that it's missing, and the cons are everything that it's missing. The next step is to finally decide. I was hoping that my decisions would look something like this, but instead, they looked like that. So, to make it easier, I came up with a method of eliminating them. I chose two charities at random. I then compared them and decided on which, and decided on which one was the best. I, one, the one that wasn't the best would be eliminated. I then chose another one. Drum roll, please. The charity that I have chosen to do for my 20 time project is Care International. You may be asking why I chose this charity. This charity helps with the fair necessities. It also helps with multiple fair necessities, meaning that it has multiple causes like clean water, economic stability, which is basically fighting poverty, and people of hunger gender equality, and as it also, um, it was also founded in 1945, meaning that this charity has 70 years of experience. Um, also, 92% of the money goes to the cause and not to the administration. It all, another major pro of this is that it helps the entire world and not just one country. Now, um, this, remember that this is only the way that I help, which by the way, if you want to help you, if you want to do the same thing, this took me a little long time to find out. So, uh, and there are so many ways that you can help the world too. If that, even if that's making, uh, teaching people how to be fashionable, picking up garbage, making a soccer YouTube channel, or even making a smile go a mile. You just have to contribute to the world in the way that suits you most. Thank you.